Welcome back. Remember in-person meetings? That was so last year. 2020 has been all about the video chat. And while working remotely has its benefits, it almost always means more screen time. And it can be tough to put your best face forward when you're noticing things like wrinkles and a new thing called tech neck. But there are some quick procedures that will have you feeling like yourself again. Well, hi, Casey. Hi, it's good to see you again. Just like many of us, former TV meteorologist turned business professional Casey Curry has found her days filled with video calls. And after all these months, she was starting to see a few things she didn't like. So, Dr. Laconi, I've been working from home. Right. And my office at home is not set up like at work. At work, I've followed all your directions. I have my computer's up high. The chair high, right? At home, I don't have that full setup. So, yeah. I'm guessing these right. lines... Right. Getting these little things we call necklace lines. And Casey's not alone with those necklace lines, also known as tech neck. About a third of full-time workers in the U.S. are still working remotely. And that means more time staring at yourself, your coworkers, even your family on a screen. But the good news is there are some easy cosmetic treatments to reverse the problem areas. Basically, this is gonna relax those muscles like those concentration lines. In one quick visit, Casey was able to get Botox in her frown lines, forehead, crow's feet, and necklace lines, and some filler in the lips, and marionette lines. Ooh. So tech neck and frown lines be gone. Casey's ready to conquer her next video call. She sure is, and Casey joins us now along with Dr. Richard Laconi from the Institute of Anti-Aging. It is great to see you both, my friends. And Casey, you look great now, like with the makeup, you're a few days after treatment. So just tell us about uh, how long did it take for that redness to go away? Because I know a lot of people see the little bumps and the redness and they think, oh no, what happened? No, and I think too, everybody's a lot more open about about you know things like botox and fillers and so you know when you have like a little you know dot we call them mosquito bites almost you know it's really no big deal you know i don't worry about covering them up but i would say a couple of days i mean really th we did this maybe on like thursday richard um and so by sunday i looked perfect uh and now today the swelling's gone on you know any little bit that i had so and casey you look you look phenomenal i understand that so typically pre-covid you would go in periodically and just do a few little touch-ups but this year, you had sort of not gone at all this entire year since January. Is that right? Well, I mean, think about it. You know, I mean, we all, I think, were a little bit hesitant to do anything other than what we absolutely had to. And I didn't put things like Botox and fillers in my absolutely had to. And I think a lot of us feel that way. But now we've got a handle on, I think, how to be safe when we go places, especially when we go to a physician's office like Dr. Laconi's. And it just was the time. I had just gotten to the point where I just really looked exhausted all the time. And so it just got to the tipping point for me where I just, I couldn't take it anymore. So thankfully, Dr. Laconi was able to whip it up real quick. Well, you don't look <laughs> exhausted anymore. You look camera ready, that bright smile. Dr. Laconi, let's talk about Botox and fillers because I, I think those words, it, unless you've done it before and you know just what it can do for your own life and your own face, a lot of people may steer away because of fear. So just kind of walk us through what they are, how they can be used, and how long they last. Well, you know, uh, facial fillers, as you said, have been around for a very long time. It's a very simple technique. It uses uh, biologically natural substances to fill the places where your face has lost some volume, under the eyes, uh, in the cheeks, lips, things like that. Again, it's a perfectly natural substance. Botox, you know, again, that's been around for almost 20 years now, billions of doses given. And yet it's great for relaxing wrinkles in the forehead, around your eyes, and other uses too. And we're seeing some video right now of the application process uh, when Casey had her treatments last week. Uh, the, the redness, any, any temporary bumps, when can people expect those things to go away and, and you know, sort of experience the full effects of the treatment? That actually, it's that's a matter of minutes, you know, for the... Botox, those little bumps are gone in 34 minutes. Uh, I think, you know, the most uh, visible thing sometimes you may get a bruise, maybe one out of 10 times, a little bruise that goes away in a day or so. It so really... it's really a very, very simple uh, procedure and you can tolerate. 
Yeah, simple, tolerable for sure. And this little needle we're seeing right now, that's actually like the same as a pediatric needle. It's a tiny, tiny little needle. You barely feel anything. I know this because Dr. Lacone, you do my Botox as well. Casey, would you say, fair to say that your confidence level has gone up since you were able to get back in and sort of, you know, do, do the routine? <laughs> Well, and you know, and in, in, in my job now, I still have to do video presentations and I, I do some emceeing work. And so it's important that I look like I got the sleep that I wish I had. And that's the best part about it is I find that I'm wearing less makeup, my skin looks better, and I just really have that awake look that I wish I had, you know, pre-COVID, pre-job, pre-kids, you know, all of that kind of good stuff. So for me, it's absolutely worth it. Well, you look like a pro, Casey. It is great to see you, Dr. Lacone. It is great to see you as well. I'll see you tonight for your virtual open house a little later on in a few hours. Great. See you then. Okay, thanks to you both. Let's toss it on over to Courtney now with some other ideas to help us look our best on our next video chat. Courtney? Okay, don't fall asleep. That's the first thing that you're supposed to do, right? Okay. <laughs> Besides Botox and fillers, by the way, Casey looks amazing before and after. Absolutely. The Institute of Anti-Aging also offers one of my favorite things, hydrofacials. I'm completely addicted to this. Dermal fusion and also photofacials. But if you can't make it into the office, there are some products that can help you look your best at home. We're going to share with you some of those next. Welcome back to Houston Life. Before the break, we were talking about how cosmetic treatments can help you put your best face forward for video calls. Dana Lacone with the Institute of Anti-Aging joins me now for a conversation in other ways that we can prevent the dreaded now word and phrase tech neck. Hi, Dana. Great to see you. Hey, hi, Courtney. Okay, you and I have chatted about Tech Neck before. Let's explain what this is because they're basically the lines and wrinkles that we're getting on our necks, right, from looking at our devices? That's right. You know what's happening? Like a lot of people are sitting at home kind of looking down, and they're basically causing these little creases in their neck. Just like if you, like, take a piece of paper and keep folding it back and forth, you're going to get a crease. And the same thing is happening every time you bend down, you are actually causing that little crease. And by the way, where do we see the signs of our true age? Hands and neck. So neck. those are two areas that we cannot forget. Okay, so let's talk about products. If somebody says, you know what, I'm nervous about doing anything to that area, we start off with different products first. What do you have? Well, we have a couple really great ones here. Um, we have TNS, which is the latest and greatest from Allergan, the makers of Botox and fillers. This, um, it, it has like essential serums, growth factors, it's fantastic. We also have um, Nectifirm, which is incredible for your neck. I mean, that will really just kind of help moisturize the neck. It has peptides in it. And then uh, we also have a store, uh, a drugstore version called CeraVe, which I absolutely love. It has peptides. I mean, it's not, of course, not as strong as some of the medical grades that we carry, but, but this is a cheaper version. So. So yeah, come on in for a consultation. We'll tell you which one is best for you. And by the way, that's about $15 or even $12 for that CeraVe. I use the, the Nectifirm based on your recommendation. And then that first serum, I'm noticing a big difference in, in the texture of the skin. But let's talk about, we are at home, we're on our devices, we're laying on, on, in bed looking at our phones or we're, you know, just like a cell phone, right? We never want that photo shooting down at us we want to be up and that's what you say is the first tip is always elevate your devices always, always elevate like even like right now i have my computer on a, on a monitor it's elevated so you're looking straight you know straight at the screen right so you're not looking down so at your home office definitely elevate even if you do what casey did put some cereal boxes under her screen that kind of helps um again you've got you've got things like this like if you're kind of walking around you, know, you can hold it up especially like if you're taking selfies um, but and here's like another really cool um, stand that I have, like you can put on your desktop, you know, you can put on your kitchen table, um, on, your off on your desk. And then my favorite of all is this little thing. You can put it around your neck, like when you're laying in bed, and you can sit there and watch a movie, you can type. So anyway, all this stuff is available on uh, Amazon. It's really cheap and very effective. Just kind of keep that neck up. Absolutely, and it just looks like it's part of the outfit. Nothing to see here. What do you mean? It's just my monitor, but we're protecting our neck. You know what? One thing that we love about you and Richard and the rest of the people at the Institute of Anti-Aging is your open houses, girl. They're always really fun, but of course, during these times, it's virtual, and today, this all starts at 4 o'clock, right? It does. Immediately following this, we're going to our virtual open house. We're going to be showing all of our uh, procedures on 
you know, live doing Botox fillers, uh, cool sculpting, cool tone. So it's a good good opportunity to kind of see what we do here and see these procedures in action. And it's great because there's going to be door prizes, special pricing on patient favorites as well. But check them out. Dana, it is so great to see you. You always have the best advice, you and Richard and the rest of the gang over there at the Institute of Anti-Aging. We miss seeing you. Love you guys. Love you too. Thanks so much, Dana. They are the best in town to connect with the Institute of Anti-Aging. Call this number, 713-807-1000, or visit them online at antiageinstitute.com. Derek? I got to get one of those neck things. I that know, looks right? very cool. All right.